Good morning. It's what day is it today? It's Sunday. And <clears throat> I'm at work. I have an eight hour shift today. I'm two hours in and I'm already feeling like uh, I'm just feeling really anxious, which is always fun at work. Uh, with my anxiety, well, I think with everyone's anxiety, it kind of tells you you can't do things. So I'm constantly like stressed out like, I can't do this, I can't do this. I just need to take a deep breath. I can do this. I can do this. It's just an eight-hour shift. I've done these before. I don't know why I'm tripping out, but it's just like, I think the pace of like, go, 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 and like, I just feel pressured, and I don't know. I just feel really weird today, which is such a bummer because I have not had a good two days. Um, but it was cool this morning. A couple of my friends from my Buddhist, I still don't know how to say this, Buddhist people, <laughs> um, my Buddhist friends came over and we set up my Gohan Zone, which is what I got last night. It's kind of, it's like a scroll thing, it's, it's more than that, but it's, I'll explain it one day. They came over and we chanted a little bit, but I didn't, ch we didn't chant very long, I should have chanted longer, but I don't know, I'm just feeling really not great, guys. <laughs> I know I've been like super depressed in the past few vlogs I think, which is I'm sorry for, but that's just how it's going right now. <laughs> I don't know. I'm home. It's been such a long... It's been such a long day. And I've not eaten all day because I needed caffeine <laughs> at lunch. And I didn't have time to eat my lunch and go to Barnes & Noble and get coffee, so I chose coffee. <laughs> and I'm now kind of hungry. I'm not, like, starving. I was more really thirsty. But yeah, I got invited to go to Veggie Grill with my coworkers, but I thought since Dalton was picking me up, I was like, No, I don't want to inconvenience him, but he ended up being, like, 20 minutes late anyway. I probably could have just went with them and had him pick me up there. But whatever, I'm going to dinner with a bunch of my coworkers tomorrow night after work, so I'll see them then. Um, yeah, I kind of want to go to the gym, but not right now. I need to give my feet a rest. If I say that to Dalton, he'll probably say, no, you got to keep up the momentum. No. <laughs> no. Good morning. I didn't realize my hair looked like this, but... um. I just wanted to show you my new mug. Look what my mom got me. It's so small. It's like really small. I don't, it's small, small. <laughs> um, it came with a little spoon, but she broke it this morning and she feels so bad, but I told her it's not a big deal. It just came with a little red spoon. And um, it's, per it's the perfect size for me because I only drink six ounces of coffee with the Keurig because in my mind it makes it stronger if there's less water. Um, because I use the Keurig with instant coffee. I just put hot water in it. But yeah. So, super cute. Also, it is 10 a.m. And it is Monday. So, I got one more little thing in the mail. And it's from England. Royal Mail. Raina de la Cruz. I love Stas's handwriting. It was Anastasia. Anastasia or Anastasia. Or honest. I don't know. But I'm going to call her Stoss. Well, Hannah calls her Anna. And by Hannah, I mean Hannah Pixie Sykes. Snowden Sykes. Tattoo artist. I think I've talked about her before with the balance book and the key zine. And she's Ollie Sykes' wife now. Um, her best friend is an artist. And I got some of her little zines. So let's see what's in here. I don't want to rip the sticker. Oh, cute. The packaging is so nice. Yay! Stuff! Okay, so I got You Are Going to Be Okay, which is one that's like little encouragements. Thank you for supporting me. Have a beautiful day, Anastasia. Um... Bye-bye. I don't remember what this one is. Let's see. 
game over, time to die. She She's a very interesting artist. Um, if you're new to her work, you might not understand it, but for my favorite, this one's cute. It's like for like your favorite person in the world, like who you love. You make me happy, even on my worst days. So yeah. Oh, and I'll, I guess I'll show you a little bit of the You Are Going To Be Okay one. Words make words to make bad days better. That's the one. You Are Going To Be Okay is part of the artwork. Um, it's called Words To Make Bad Days Better. Today can be beautiful. I like it. I'm excited. Thanks, Anastasia. I love your work. I know you're not even watching, but, you know. Um, so yeah, I love her handwriting. I love that she hand wrote the address. Oh, don't want to show you my address. It came in the mail and I was like, Royal Mail, what did I order? What did I order from England? So yeah. Okay, this is by far the weirdest shift I've ever worked since I started working here. <laughs> like, it's just, I'm not even gonna go into the details because for one, I don't think I'm allowed for several reasons, but like, it's just so weird and like anxiety ridden, like, but in a different way. It's not even anxiety, it's more just like uncomfortable. Like, it's just so weird. Anyway, I'm going to dinner after work with my coworkers. Maybe I'll vlog. I mean, only a few people know I have a YouTube channel, and I don't know if I want to tell everyone that's going to the dinner tonight. We'll see. I mean, I'm not going to do like this kind of vlogging, but maybe I'll like vlog the food if I get anything. Because yes, I'm going to eat normal food tonight. Either that or buy a drink. I don't know. <laughs> I haven't decided. But um, yeah. I'll let you guys know what I eat. And yeah, I'll let you use me from the day that we first met. But I'm not done yet. Falling for you. Hi, so I haven't vlogged at all today, but <clears throat> it's Tuesday and I went to Jenny and it's like 11 o'clock right now. I'm at the gym. I've biked a mile so far, which isn't much, but for me it's good, you know, it's good. Um, had a very emotional day. Uh, some stuff happened. I was very upset, but Dalton was there for me and being the amazing best friend that he is. And just thank God for him. Also, thank God for the main because they were getting me through um, my little cry session. The whole time I was crying, I was just listening to the main. Um, and yeah, I'm on the bike. And the reason I have like eyeshadow and lipstick is because I was playing with makeup right before I got here. And yeah. <sighs> Good morning. It's 9 a.m. and I'm on my break at work and I'm. I'm not tired, but I'm just like, I cannot think. Like, I'm doing, it's like setting up new displays and stuff. And uh, I woke up 20 minutes before I had to leave because I overslept. So I didn't have any coffee. And then I got here, and for some reason, the plan out was just so hard for me. <sighs> also, it's Wednesday. I'm at the grocery store. I just got off work and I'm exhausted. Exhausted. Oh, I'm getting paid this week. I can finally get my mom the flower. Um, look at this fruit. Three for ten. Three for ten. Today did not go very well. It took me forever to do what I was supposed to do. And, yeah. I don't even know if you can hear me because I think I'm blocking the mic. Oh, well. Um, I'll see you guys when I get home. I'm in a crazy mood because I'm so tired and I just chugged a Red Bull. My hair is so flat and greasy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Wow, that was really weird. <laughs> oh my god, what's happening with my hair?
I'll stop now. <laughs> That's sad meeting. With what? 20 or 30? Oh, 20. Rainy recording? Yeah, I feel like I have a beauty team. Do you prefer a brown? Holy crap. So different. I clearly don't know how to do makeup, guys. Okay. This is Raina. You want me to talk in it? Sure. <laughs> and we are doing a tortoise ombre. A tortoise balayage. She's going to look fabulous. Let's hold up a little bit too, but I'm going to use her natural, like her eye socket, to get her crease. And sometimes just depending upon what kind of shape you want to do, like if you want to do a cat eye or if you want to do rounded, that's how you can define your outer right here. Okay. Are you going to fall asleep? No. Are you just like going to sleep on her? <laughs> her oh my gosh, imagine her head falls right into her yeah. coffee. Do you want me to hold your coffee? Hey, do you want someone to hold it? Are you kind of done right now? Oh, no. I'm, You're okay, I, just, right I just want to make sure I don't spill it. We're like, worried you're going to sleep. I coordination that like... If I'm not looking at something, I'll kind of yeah, tip things over. <laughs> Sorry. Go and start defining a little more. It's best to use smaller brushes to get up into these areas, especially because she has like monolid. So now we can go through. <laughs> Let's see. Do, do you want to do? We'll, well, I guess we'll continue with your browns. So maybe we'll do sable. Thank you. Oh my God! It looks so good. All right, guys. So let me explain what all of that was. Basically, I was helping with this kind of training in our salon, and um, I was the model for it, and they'd look at my makeup. My makeup has never looked this good. Look at this contour. Look at the bronze. Look at the, the glow, the eyebrows. My, um, the girl who did my makeup is incredible. Look at my eyeshadow. That's, I, I never can get it like that. She told me how to do it and stuff. And then my hair is the biggest thing. Look at my hair. It's so different. I love it. Also, it is um, Thursday today. <laughs> Hello. So I just wanted to show you guys with my camera, like my hair. So they did a tortoise something. That's what it's called. So yeah, that's the hair. Um, and then my makeup. Look how good it looks. It's darker on one side because she was doing two different techniques. I'm going to even it out in a little bit. Um, before I go to work because I'm totally wearing this makeup. Also, she used the Born This Way foundation on me and my skin has never looked better. Look at the contour. Look at that contour. So good. Ugh, my coworkers are incredible. Good morning. It's Friday. I got paid at midnight last night and I seriously am addicted to online shopping. Um, I got some stuff from Colourpop and... I ordered two things from Torrid, and then today I went on Forever, because I had a gift card for like seven bucks for Forever 21, I was like, oh, I'll just use that online and get some accessories. Lord knows I ended up getting more stuff, but I figure I can return the stuff if I don't want it, um, and I'm going to make it my, I'm going to make it my goal to not smoke for the next two weeks, because I don't have enough money to buy cigarettes. Actually, do I? I, no, I don't. Fuck. I have a question for you guys. Ever since I started my working life, which was at 16, my mom has always asked, how much money did you make this week? How much money do you have in your bank account? How much money did you get for financial aid? What's in your bank account now? What have you been doing? Like, do any of your parents do this? Just curious. Hi, so it's technically Saturday, but I haven't gone to sleep, so I consider it Friday still. Oh crap, I need to upload this video. <laughs> How did it get to the end of the week so fast? That's crazy. Um, anyway, today has been a rough day. Uh, well, not a rough day. I had a good day. I had a good shift at work. But before that, you know, from the previous clip that ended up getting cut off because my phone ran out of memory, um, as you can see, I was kind of annoyed with my mom and the money situation. Um, uh, money is always the center of something in, in family and in 
not to say that we, you know, we're a terrible family. We're not. I love my family and everything, but it's just the money stuff gets gets annoying. But um, basically, I and she had every right to be un, like angry with me. I guess um, I got paid at midnight last night, so technically today and. Um, or yesterday, I guess. You know what I mean. I got paid. And I basically spent all of it already. Um, I got some makeup. But then I also ordered some clothes. Clothes. From Forever, from Forever 21. I had a little gift card to there, so I was like, oh, I'll just get it. Um, and I also started looking at the backpacks. And then I saw, like, a pair of shoes that I wanted. And then I got two tops. And, yeah, I don't know. Um, I went a little crazy, and I'm kind of getting addicted to online shopping. I told Dalton, I was like, hey, next time I get paid, remind me to pull out all my money as soon as I get paid. And just, like, give it to my parents. Um, just so then, I won't have to stress about my mom being like, where's your money? And how much money do you have? And da -da -da -da. Because she'll have it, so she'll know. And if she spends it, then so be it. I mean, Lord knows I owe her money. And nothing's free, kids. Nothing's ever free. Um, but yeah, so we, that happened. And then I was, like, kind of annoyed. And I have a few things that I turn to for comfort. Drugs, which I don't do anymore. So that left me with food to turn to for comfort. And so I was like, you know what, fuck it. Um, like, I've been craving a burger for days, so I, and the bad thing is, since I was craving a burger for days, I ended up going hog wild at Jack in the Box and getting a burger, fries, and jalapeno poppers. That's a lot of food. Um, and, uh, you know, I, I, that was it. Like, I was gonna continue the rest of my day with, with the Jenny dinner or whatever and a salad. And then there was pizza at work because one of my coworkers got, like, promoted, kind of. And, um, so there was, there was, like, a celebration. So I had pizza for dinner. So today was basically a cheat day. And I, th I hate telling you guys this. Um, just because I know that it sounds disappointing. Um, because my progress is constantly, like, it seems like I, I either go like this and then down and then up and then down and then up. And it's not good. I haven't fully worked out the kinks. I'm definitely an emotional eater, and it's really hard for me to stop that. And I'm I'm such an emotional person that food is a factor, like, 90% of the time. And I don't know. I don't know. But I guess I'll end the vlog here. Um, actually, I don't want to end the vlog on a bad note, so I'll end it in the morning. But, yeah. Um, I did weigh myself, because I was, I was, I told myself I wasn't going to, because I was like, I'm going to hate myself if I gained, like, 20 pounds. I gained 2 pounds, which isn't that bad. I can just, if I work really hard over the next few days, hit the gym, like, twice a day, and be really strict with Jenny, which I tell myself I'm going to be all the time, and then I never am. If I'm really strict with Jenny and going to the gym, I'll be fine by the weigh-in on... Tuesday. And honestly, I'm thinking about just lying to my parents. <laughs> As in, like, if they ask, like, oh, how'd you do? Oh, I lost six pounds. It's great. Like, I feel like I can't be honest with them because I'll get reprimanded. <laughs> um, I mean, with good reason. You know, they're worried about me and it's their money. They're paying for, for Jenny Craig for me, which I greatly, greatly appreciate. Um, you know, so obviously they, they don't want to waste their money on a program that I'm not doing correctly. So I get it, you know. I cannot wait for the day that I'm just completely independent and I'm trying to get there. I really am. Like, well, I guess I'm not since I'm not saving any money to try to move out. So I guess I'm just a fuck up in general, guys. Like, I'm just not doing, I'm just... I'm full of great decisions. But yeah, I'm gonna go because this has been a long clip. I'll see you in the morning. I'm looking right at you. But you're
you're not there I'm seeing right past you But you seem well aware Your body is here But your mind is somewhere else So far gone And you think I can't tell Can't tell that you are disconnected You fall away and I miss your presence I always said to you Baby you should be here, right here, baby. You should be here, right here. Don't know where you went, but you lost now. Don't know where you went, but you're gone. Don't know where you went, but you lost now. Don't know where you went, but you're gone now. Good morning. Actually, it's not morning. I had a very long lie-in today. I woke up at like 8.30 and then ended up going back to sleep until 12. Um, not much plan for today, just editing and taking surveys because, I don't know, what do you guys, I haven't heard too much about the whole sur online surveys for rewards thing, but I thought I'd give it a go. If you've heard anything, please let me know in the comments because it's possible that these could just be scams. I'm using a pretty trusted website to find the survey website, so I think it's okay. And it's not like I'm giving any, like, credit card information or anything. Yet. So, um, yeah, just let me know if you heard anything about it. I've heard a little bit from, like, friends and, like, on Tumblr, but not, not much besides that. So, yeah. Um, and then I work at 6.30, so I will see you guys in next week's vlog if you only watch my vlogs or in the Jenny update on Tuesday. Bye!